between the accessibility to your personal finance data and to your healthcare information. What would happen if one day you are on vacation and you try to withdraw cash from an ATM other than your usual bank and you are not able to get it because the bank doesn't recognize you? It would be unbelievable for you because you ha are used to have access to your money at any time, in any place, on any device. It is there when you need it. But what happens if you are abroad and suddenly you have an accident? You should go to a hospital that is not the one you are used to go. So there's a good chance that they don't have access to your medical records. And why is that? That's because your information is not yours. So you should undergo through a series of tests and scans before being treated or even diagnosed. So we need to change the way we manage patient information. How many people can speak two languages? And 20? Developers, contrary to what it may seem, are humans. So it's impossible for them to have in-depth knowledge of 20 different and constantly evolving technologies at a time. The fact is that it's very expensive in time and labor to develop healthcare software from scratch, but what can we do? I don't know, but as a hospital, I know what I need. I need to have access to my, all my data. I need um, almost anywhere, anytime. I need digital signature, handwriting, and voice recognition. Uh, and I've tried to do so many times before, but I have a problem. Once I deploy the application, I realize that it is already outdated. So I had to start all over again. It's kind of messy. Developer cycle of life, I guess. Uh, but if you think this is a bad situation, don't even consider talking about costs. Okay. Don't worry about standards, devices, technologies. The only thing you should worry about is about managing health information. We are developing a platform that integrates, updates, and changes all the technologies that you need in a transparent way. In fact, uh, me as a hospital, I don't want to be bothered about technologies. All I care is about patients and data. So what you mean is that we can build up a new healthcare application just taking into account the consideration or requirements of the department? Yeah. It does not only meet the main standards, but it also implements the specific requirements of the main med vendors of the market. The platform connects and integrates the main multi-vendor technologies, offering a standard inputs and outputs for you. <laughs> yeah, sure, this, this sounds amazing, but maybe I should have told you before something. I don't want to connect just my clinics, hospital, or even healthcare system. I want to put the patient in the middle of the circle. I want to empower him so he can access to the data anywhere, anytime. Okay, I'm, I'm completely agree with you. Stemming the tide is not a valid approach nowadays. Healthcare systems are trying to be more efficient every day because time is money. The framework that we are developing is a widely open platform that not only integrates devices and technologies, but it also allows you to exchange medical records between the patient and the clinics, between clinics or even healthcare systems. For us, it's very important to empower patients. We make possible for them to have access to their data if they need it. I know what you're thinking right now. Many people say that they can do this, but no, in fact, most of them don't. Uh, we are this is not science fiction, we are doing it. We are doing our first trials in Spain and we are being able to give this platform to our developers. So here are, being, here are developing a fully cardiology database, which is not only being able to give some tools to the doctors, but it, also improving, it is also improving the data quality of all the information so they can have advanced analytics of that or, or everything and it is done in less than one year. But we are also trying to push a step forward the research. We are giving tools so researchers can build their own applications easily and fast. Right now, we are working with an insulin tho uh, dose calculator, which is uh, being built up in less than one month. This is amazing, and we wanna share this with you. And we wanna 
asks you a question, will you join us? We, are, we want to join forces between devices, wearables, developers, but most importantly between doctors and patients. So we all together can build the most efficient healthcare system ever. Thank you.